and welcome back to my channel. Today I have my Trend Sun box. And this just came, and very quickly, because I want to get right into this try on. Trend Sand is a style service subscription box, and it is styled through the company Ever Eve. Ever Eve has locations all throughout the United States, but they do not have one in New York where I am located. So I get very excited to do this box. I do order through Ever Eve itself, but one of the big perks about ordering through Trend Sand. If you keep four or more items, you get a percentage off, and we'll go over that more in the wrap-up later. But I do like ordering this box because if I buy a couple of items and I do hit that four or more mark, I get a little bit of a discount. I also could get a discount by those using my link in the comments, and I'll run across the screen what that discount is as well. But that said, I want to get into this Trend Sun box. I love Trend Sun, and I don't do this as often as I should because their clothes are a little pricey, but yet I somehow order from the site sometimes even when I don't have a box. If I see something I like or they do have a sale before I get to do a box. But anyways, let me read my stylist note, and then we're going to go right into this first outfit. So I've been styled again by Simone G. And reading glasses on. Simone says, Janine, happy Trend Sun Day. I hope you're doing well and enjoying autumn in Seaford. I received your message and styled this box with the most valuable layers theme and was able to send the joggers from your wish list and some of the exact pieces featured in the lay down um, two. She says, I don't know if that makes sense, but um, if the other items on your wish list become available, I'll send them in the next box. Have fun trying everything on. And thank you for leaving such great feedback. I really appreciate you letting me know what you love. So that's my note. I do have the first outfit on, so we're going to switch on up and get talking about this. Hang on. So I'm back. And I have on the first outfit, I guess you could say. There's two items that I have on as of right now and I'm gonna throw a jacket on over this in a couple of minutes but on top this top is this is by John and Jen this is the Hadley turtleneck pullover in the color taffy and it's in a size small and I'm gonna pull back so you can see I have it paired with a paired are by page these are Cindy with raw hem, they're ash black, and they're um, size 28. I have to say, they have a little room in them. I'm normally a 27, so both jeans are a 28. They don't fit bad. Maybe they run a little bit smaller. I don't know. I know I put on a couple of pounds, but I'm not 100% I'm not sure, to be honest. But I do know I put a belt on because there was some little bit of gaping in the back. However, through the legs and everything else, I, they're comfortable enough. Um, but I do want to show you a little bit of the detailing with this top. So I don't know if you can see. The turtleneck doesn't bother me per se, but I'm not a huge fan of turtlenecks. I know a lot of people have issues with things like touching their neck. It's not so much that. I don't know. I just, I could take it or leave it. But... The detail on this top, like it's like a button detail, except it's kind of long. So that's kind of annoying me because I wear my jewelry and I don't know if you can see, it just goes right underneath. And I would cuff it up, but you're missing the button detail to a certain extent. So I'm not sure. But the way I have this styled, I have it tucked in. This is my own belt from a previous um transcend haul and then i have the jeans which i will pare down to show you the full effect below but um let me pull back as far as i can for you though to see so there's working pockets in the front here is the back working pockets in the back it is a really cute outfit although i'm not so comfortable with this part of me and I know the, the big trend right now is tucking in but this kind of is a little bit more clingy so I'm not so sure how I feel but want to try on 
the jacket. This is a huge heavy jacket. Then I will pan down to those jeans. So she included this jacket and I'll come closer so you can see the color and everything. But I do want to give you the information about this jacket. This is the Poppy Vegan Leather Puff. It is by, I think you say this is Jake. It's in the color biscuit and it's a size small. So let me show you the color at least. There's the color. It has like the elastic, the wrist. And it is that vegan leather as they said. It has a hood. So as the hood. It is really nice. It has a zipper. Hang on, so it does zip all the way up and it has room. So for like layering, but this is the front of it. it has pockets. The pockets have snaps. So it has like snap closure in the pockets. And it can zip pretty much all the way up to keep you warm. So here's the front, here's the back. I don't know, I mean, it's definitely warm. I'm not the type that likes like bulky layers, but um, I usually go with like a jacket where I can layer underneath and I can pull the layers off, but it is cute. So, but I did want you to see that before we pan down to the jeans. So. Let me pan down to the jeans next. Hang on. Okay, I'm back with the jeans. So here, if I pull back, you could see the full length. They have a raw hem, and I'm wearing my own boots. These I bought from Ever Eve, because I don't always get shoes in my Transcend boxes. So I bought these from Ever Eve leave their Dolce Vita. I will double check and if I'm wrong there'll be a note running across the screen but it's just the way I wore them with my own boots today. I do like them. I have another pair of jeans similar color from last year so I'm gonna have to see these versus those if I actually need these but that is outfit one. We'll be back in a moment. Okay, I'm back and I literally just switched out the top. I kept the jeans on and everything else I had on, the belt, the shoes, but I switched out the top and this top that you're gonna see is by Rails. It is the Angelica Check Button Down. It's in a size small and the color says Malt Onyx. So, let me back up so you can see. And then I'll come closer so you can see the color. I did a front tuck and I just have the back hanging out. I mean, it can be worn different ways, but kind of liking this look with the color, these color um, jeans. Like I said, I think I have, I actually think I have two pairs that are similar color. I think one is by Seven for All Mankind and another is A Goldie. So I'm not sure I need these, but man, are these comfortable, I'm not gonna lie. Um, so yes, this is the Rails top. And that's the um, color, so it's like, I don't wanna say it's white, it's like a gray and black checker. And what I really like is the sleeve has like this, it's like pleating detail. On the shoulder, it has like the pleating puff detail. And I have it open. I mean, you can button it all the way up. I'm sorry, I would not wear it buttoned all the way up. So I kind of like it just slightly open. Um, but Rails is pricey, I'm not gonna lie. And we will talk about pricing later on. But um, I don't know, I do love Rails though. As pricey as this brand is. And this top is very soft and comfortable. So yeah, I do kind of like this. And like I said, I have jeans in a similar color that this could go with. So I don't know, it's a possibility, but hang on. 
and I'm gonna switch into the next item. Okay, I'm back, and I have on two more items in this box. So I have my foam so I can see the actual items. So the first item is the Reagan pullover, and the, the top itself, this sweater, is by Ever Eve. And then I'm gonna pull away and then we'll discuss the whole outfit. But the bottom, the jeans, are the Isla cropped boot, and these are by Citizen of Humanity. So let me come closer. Put that down a sec. Okay. Want you to see this has like that, it's almost like that Nordic feel to it can see it better on the sleeve detail. The sleeves are very long. Again, I'm one to wear jewelry and I hate when my jewelry is covered, but I get I'm small and petite, you know, so that is an issue. But let me back up so you can see I front tucked the sweater into the jeans and we're going to pan down and look at the jeans in a moment. But here is the front. Let me untuck it so you can see the whole sweater and then see the back. And with the jeans, there are front working pockets. There are also pockets in the back as well. So let me pan down so you can see them real quick. Okay, here are the jeans. And I have them paired with, I don't even remember the brand of these boots, but I got these on from Ever Eve a couple of years ago. So I just haven't paired with my black like combat boots from Ever Eve. So you can see the length. They are wide leg. They do have a hem. Um, they're not cut off or anything like that. There's no distressing. Okay, I'm back. And I just switched out the top I was wearing and I'm still wearing the same jeans, boots, all of that. But on top, I am wearing the Sabine Shoulder Detailed Crew, and this is by Nation LTD. So let me come closer so you can see the color. It's in this kind of blue, dark, like dark blue color. It has on the wrist elastic on my wrist. And then if you can see the shoulder detail, it's like pleated so you can see the full effect. I have it front tucked. I'll untuck it in a second. I just want you to see here is the back. And untucked just so you can see the full length of the top. So again, Nation LTD. Um, it's cute, but this is pricey, I can tell you that. I'm sure you'll see all the prices running across the screen. So yeah, kind of on the pricey side, but I'm not sure. So hang on, I have one more outfit I wanna try on for you. Back with the next outfit, which has the last three clothing items. And then I have a hat and a pair of mittens I just wanna show you quickly as well. So. Let's jump in. On top, I have, this is by Ever Eve, the Sierra Marl cardigan. And underneath, I have the Ringer Tee by Goldie. And also on the bottom, when I pan away, I just have black joggers on. These are the by Varley, the Sienna jogger. So, let's discuss all of these items. And I will take the cardigan off in a few minutes to show you the um, t-shirt. Oh my goodness, sorry guys. And also, let me just tell you about the hat and the mittens though first. So, the hat is by also by Varley. It is the Cresta Beanie, and I'm going to grab it in a second. And then I have the mittens, which are by Harriet Isles, the Ally Sherpa Mitten. So I'm not going to put the mittens on, but let's take a look at them real quick so you can see them. 
I'm not a mittens girl. I mean, these are cute, I guess. Well, maybe I'll put one on just so you can see, but I don't want to separate them. But here is the mittened hand. I really am not a mittens girl, so I don't know if I would keep these or not, to be honest. But they're very soft and, oh my gosh, fuzzy and everything else. But yeah, I'm not, I don't know. But cute. And then the hat. Let me see if I can put it on real quick. I'm going to try. I don't, I have makeup on, so I know it's white. So I'm not going to put it all the way down because I don't want to get the makeup that I'm wearing on it. But that's the beanie, the hat. It's cute. Um, well, let's see if I can get you a closer look. Hang on. It is by, it's by Varley. So the Varley tag is on there. It's just like a cream white color, but it's cute. Sorry. I do have other hats, so I'm not sure. I have to go through and see what I have. But now let's get to the sweater first. And let's take a look at the colors pretty it's like a black and white color that's the wrist um, has buttons I have it buttoned up but I will unbutton it in a second because I want to show you the t-shirt so here's the front here's the back we will pan down to look at the leggings in a few moments but let me take this sweater off and open it so you can see it. So here's the outfit with the cardigan open. Now let me take it off now so you can see the t-shirt. For a plain simple t-shirt, again, I will have all either pricing going across or definitely in the comments so you can see this t-shirt I know is pretty pricey. And it's just a plain gray t-shirt. I think the only distinguishing mark is that the collar has white and black stripe it's very very soft but again it's just a t-shirt so and I have it front tucked let me untuck it so you can just see the length of it fully so there's the length out the length in the back I'm gonna front tuck it again because I want you to be able to see the joggers okay so before I pan down the joggers have working pockets in the front the joggers also have a working pocket in the back it's a zippered pocket so that's a nice feature um really like them they're soft they're lightweight but they're very comfortable not gonna lie um Varley, I have leggings by them. Their leggings are the softest, um, like butter type material, and it's the same with these joggers. Um, just so comfortable. And they also have, I have hidden inside, but they do have, it's like a gold colored drawstring. But I pulled it and I put it inside. So they're inside the jogger I'm sorry I'm not playing with myself but I'm just trying to get that back in I just wanted you to see it but we're gonna pan down and look at them now so I just pan down and I'm literally just wearing my Nike black and white sneakers with this so comfortable joggers have just a very very loose elastic at the bottom not even really they are very comfortable and I do like these I'm not gonna lie because I work fully remote so these would be great to have and wear at home while I'm working so hang on and we're gonna come back with a quick recap okay I'm back with a quick wrap-up I am still wearing the rails button down that I tried on but just as a quick wrap up here because you've seen everything and i love your feedback pricing like i said is was either going to go across or you could see the pricing in the comments along with if you click on my link in the comments you can get 20 percent off if you're interested in signing up and trying transcend for yourself but if i keep four or more items in this transcend box 
I get 10% off on top of everything that you've seen me try on. If I pick four or more items, I get the 10% off. So I need to know, guys, because this box is pretty expensive. I have an idea of what I'm really liking, but I'd love to know your thoughts as well. So leave me some comment love and let me know. And if you are a subscriber already, big thanks for all of your support. If you aren't, hit the subscribe button below. If you like this video, give me the thumbs up. And now I just want to say, have a magical day and bye for now.